Hi folks, in this video I'm going to show you how to create a button to conditionally show or hide uh, different charts. There's been videos done on this before, but I thought I'd do a new one. So the first thing we need to do is create our variable. We're going to create a new variable called vshow. And we click OK. So now we, we can add this over here. We can say the next thing we need to do is create a button. Our button is called, going to be for now. It's going to be called uh, chart one. I'm going to add an action to this to set the variable v show to zero. So now what we'll do is if we change, actually the next thing is actually to say. Uh, v show in the conditional layout of chart one v show is equal to zero and we just copy that and for chart two we'll say conditional and v show is equal to one so as soon as we put in v show equals to one the chart on the right disappears and the chart on the left um, remains because the v show is equal to zero so we change this to one and press enter you can see now this chart um chart two reappears so we want the button to conditionally do this um, and we want the label of the button to change so at the moment it's just setting the if we click on this button here it then changes this variable here so we want to do both steps at the same time so if we say equals if uh, v show equals zero comma one comma zero and then in here we'll say for our text we'll say if uh, v show equals we just put in equals because of the text object so if v show equals zero comma chart one comma chart two so if we click ok on that now if we click this button you'll see that chart two is now shown if we click it again chart one chart two and then what we can do is we can just copy the Copy the X and Y position, so 75, 225, and then just copy that into the same. So 75 and 225, click OK, and now when we click on our button, we can click between chart one and chart two. I hope that makes sense. There are other videos out there, including video a video by um Quintelligence. So you can check that out and i think i've done a previous video a couple of years ago so that's pretty much it for this one um i hope that helps and i'll see you next video cheers